this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Guns N' Roses. I mean, let's play Chrono Cross! Nikki went into this waterfall for no apparent reason. Welcome! Oh, how do you know that? I could have just been coming here for spelunking. What is spelunking, anyway? Uh, I don't know. Do, do any of you go spelunking, viewers? There were a lot of posters of him in Termina, and Arnie, for that matter. Sister. Oh, okay. So you have a sister. Okay, well, what is your secret? Sure, why not? If you say no, he just forces his way into your party anyway. Rock out, Nikki! Yeah! The Spoonie Bard, Nikki! No, no, uh, maybe later. Yeah, play your guitar in a cave. That sounds like a plan. So what's the secret to this place anyway? Well, we already found that out from the mushroom guy. Just remember, don't eat the mushrooms. You'll find out why later, viewers. But anyway, uh, oh, we have to feed a monster to one of the other monsters and somehow get them over there. Well, couldn't we just kill one and drag it over there? I mean, it's going to die anyway. Oh, okay. Well, let's get some more information. Wait a minute. What are you going to do? You, you want us to go to Termina to rescue your sister for you? Or are you going to pay us or anything? Or how are we going to get you into our party? Oh, there we go. Okay, yeah, um, we, we get him into our party here. You don't have to bring Nikki along, just like you didn't have to bring Guile along once you got there, or to uh, wherever he was in the bluffs. But uh, we, it's a good idea, at least for storyline purposes. Nikki's not that bad either, stat-wise. And we get an aroma pouch here, but what's that do? Sure, let's read the letter again. Monster blocking a path, aroma pouch, and, oh, okay. There's some weird looking plants out there that uh, have some pollen in them. So you gotta capture it with the aroma pouch and then use the aroma pouch with the, well, aroma from the pollen to lure a monster over there. I think it would be a whole lot easier just to kill one of the monsters and then bring it along, but, uh, you know, we gotta do it this way. And we get an angry scapula from the letter, too. Oh, that must be uh, Skelly's angry scapula. I was angry for having no shoulders. Or bad shoulders. Well, don't worry, uh, Skelly. The big shoulder looks out anyway. Okay, so now that we've got Nikki into my party, I want to take a moment to uh, equip him with Alina's elements and the iron pick that we got for him, and be right back. Okay, we're all set and ready to go, so we got to get past that monster to the left there. You see those weird looking plants, like in the upper left and the right, and there's one on the bottom there? It, now that we have the aroma pouch, you examine them, you get this little floaty ball following you. I guess that represents the pollen or the aroma or whatever we got going on here. You got to get the color of the pollen to match the color of the monster. And uh, depending on which color monster you feed it, you will get a different result. Some of them are bad and you will have to fight the big monster. In order to avoid fighting the monster, you have to get the hardest colored monster over to it and feed it to him. Now what you want to do is keep the little floaty ball just barely ahead of the monster. If the monster catches up with it, it will eat it and you'll have to start all over. If you get too far ahead of the monster, the monster will lose interest and you'll, well, you won't have to start over, but you'll have to get its attention again. So you gotta be real careful with this. Now up to now, this part has been pretty easy since I cleared all the monsters out of the way. But uh, this turn right around this corner here can be a little, you see I lost its interest there. Come on, follow the food, there we go. Come on, get around the corner. Yes, got it. Whew. Okay, well there we go. It's boss time! Let's take this thing out. What? What's going on? Well, since we fed it the red monster, it just shrivels up into a little monster and starts speaking in leech speak, or whatever you call it when it starts doing capitals and lower cases like that. 
we get the Skullduggery frame from it. You can get that on either of the other two paths as well later in the game, but uh, not right now. Okay, so let's just get in this tree and make it to Viper Manor. Uh-oh. Not these guys again. I guess uh, Mickey didn't distract them so well. Well, even they know about the secret entrance to Viper Manor. I guess maybe it's not so secret after all. All right, this is the real boss now. Zoa, huh? One of the four Davids, just like Karsh, huh? Hopefully he's just as easy. And his little uh, mannerism is to speak in all caps. I don't like it when people write in all caps, especially on YouTube, but it's better than like a bad accent like the rest of the characters have. Uh-oh, they got a new element. A summon element? Oh, crap. I'm totally unprepared for a summon element. Nuts. Ah! What? Nothing happened. What's going on? Oh, okay. Yeah, in order to use a summon element, the field effect has to be all the same color of that element. So, like, he was trying to cast a yellow summon element, and, well, it didn't work because the field effect was not all yellow. So... There, there you go. We're safe. <laughs> yeah, they're just in there for uh, comic relief, I guess. So let's take out Zoa first, like I should have done when I was fighting Karsh back there. If you can ever hit him. Hit him, Surge! Hit, hit the guy! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Anyway, uh, you can't do anything, Surge. You idiot. Um, now the thing with Postal and Nikki is that they only have nine stamina recovery, so that can be a problem. Let's go again. Let's use Arrow Saucer against Zoa, I guess. I would imagine that if you leave Zoa alone, it will become unpleasant. Uh, yeah, let's have Nikki go. Let's show off his level three tech. I love his level three tech, not because it's that good. It's just cool. That's all. And they're casting buffs and debuffs and stuff like that. Not that I really care. And I don't really care much for many of the buffs and debuffs. There's a few that I like, but like high res and low res, eh, I just don't care about them. What happened to this guy? This guy never has that good of aid. What the hell, game? Strengthen's a pretty good buff. And eagle eye. But not for them. I mean, they're always going to hit me anyway, so what the hell do I care? Uh, let's see. Grand Finale. Yeah, let's use that one on him. I don't know how a rock star can have a Grand Finale. <laughs> I love that level 3 tech. I, I don't know where he gets that endless supply of guitars, but I suppose pro wrestlers can do it, so why not, you know, a real rock star? Uh-oh. Hit Nikki, hit Nikki. Or, oh, well that didn't do too much anyway. Okay. Yeah, Postal's got pretty good, or, well, defense, or whatever the stat is for that, so. Come on, can no, I can't hit the. Yeah, Postal's not too good as a, uh, what is it, as a attacker in this battle, because everyone's yellow here, so. Oh, well. Hopefully I can finish these guys off, eventually. Yeah, let's go after uh, Salt now. My strategy for this battle is to actually hit the guy first, and then go one, two, three element over and over again. But I don't know why I am having such a hard time hitting these guys today. It's ridiculous. Uh-oh, here's their dual tech. Don't hit Nikki, don't hit Nikki. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, you know what? I want Surge to actually uh, try and finish one of you guys off, if I can. Then I'll start healing up later. Did I get him? Yes, we got him. Two down, one to go. Oh, right, Mickey's a little behind on stamina there. Nuts. Well, fortunately, he's not too hard. Let's see. Arrow Saucer. Go, Nikki, go! He's got a decent magic stat, at least when I'm recruiting him. Yeah, got all three of them. Now we can make it to Viper Manor. Good job with your guitar there, Nikki. <laughs> the sound waves, the music is so horrible! I can't take it anymore! Yeah, I had to use some uh, consumable elements. 
Oh well, I wanted to finish this boss battle sometime today. What's with this sad music all of a sudden? Where did that come from? Oh well. So can we make it through the hordes of monsters to Viper Manor? Find out next time on Let's Play Chrono Cross! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.